What's good, YouTube, man? It is your boy, Hollywood Troy, man. Back with yet another video, you guys, and it feels so good to be getting this last video of this year out for y'all. And that is me reviewing the recently released The Air Jordan 2 Chicago. Let's get it. <laughs> I do have in my hand the recently released Air Jordan 2 Chicago. Now, you guys, this right here is one of the most hated Jordans uh, probably of all time, I want to say. The, the colorways that they usually produce the shoe in, it's just really not appealing to a lot of people. And this is one of the reasons why a lot of people hate it. Therefore, you go and go down to the design of the shoe. And I can see why a lot of people would hate the design of the shoe. It's not appealing at all to a lot of eyes and uh to my eyes it's, it 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 gets that pass that that it's still appealing to me i mean it's a nice shoe it's it's an air jordan that i could tolerate for it's like all the air jordans after the air jordan 14 that i just don't really have no care for mm. then again probably like a few more like the 18 and i think the 17s i could i could rock with those two as well but this is one of them air jordans that a lot of people just don't even go down the line and talk about it all day why a lot of people just don't mess with these. Uh, number one, that's not designed by Tinker Headfield. Uh, I think the person who designed Air Force Ones designed this shoe. Uh, so I will get the correct information uh, in a little bit. Other than that, you guys, this shoe right here, it was a shoe that I just had to cop. Uh, I'm going to compare it to an Air Jordan 2 shoe that I have, which is the Air Jordan 2 Low Chicago. Now, you guys, this right here is like a... That yeah, man, a, an identical shoe to this one, just a low top version. This right here, the high top version. Just version. This is the one that did just come out, and this is the Air Jordan Two that I have. Oh man, probably. I see it's a little different. It has red insoles, uh, some red lining right here on the uh, on the. Oh damn, I can't even think of the name of it. Anyway, the Jordans that I bought way back in 2016 or 17, man, when I was just down and out, they really had no money, but they wanted some Jay. You know, I was making a little bit of money. And uh, I just wanted some J's, man. All the J's was getting sold. I just wanted some J's that I was looking at that kind of like came out past tense uh, already without. And these right here was the cheapest ones that I could find. I think I paid no more than like about a hundred or something for these, probably probably two hundred something. I don't know. All the other ones was hitting. You know, all the ones that I really liked was already hitting still back then for like three, two, four hundred something like that. But this was the lowest ones that I got. And I want to say that I got these from Flight Club, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, this is the Air Jordan 2 Low, and I finally have an authentic Air Jordan 2 High. So before we get into some deep, deep detailing in this shoe, because there is a lot of deep, deep detailing in the shoe, you guys. I'm just going to say some of the history with Jordan did way back in like an 85, 87 and everything when the shoe came. I forgot what year. I think it was 85 or 86. I could be mistaken. I so I put it down here somewhere. Anyway, he uh, broke scoring records and he also also won his first uh, dunk contest with this shoe. I want to say. Uh, so I will also put that down here in the comments if I'm not mistaken, you guys. So he did some some there's some history behind this shoe and the designer of uh, what the Air Jordan One, which I think it's like Pete something. And he did a great silhouette with the Air Jordan 1, but the designer behind this shoe, I forgot his name. I would definitely put that up there. I'm going to say his name in a hit uh, when we, you know, get into detail and everything. Uh, he also was a designer, as I said, of the Air Force 1 as well. So he made that great shoe. Uh, I'm just going to go out and say it for everybody else. I don't know what went wrong with this one, but like I said, I like the shoe. Now, if this shoe, like, I'm not even going to hold you guys on females, this shoe will look great with smaller feet this shoe will come out looking excellent like i already can picture it right now just imagine if the shoe right here was smaller and on a female feet where it's like about a size five or something like that they feet will be popping it, it'll look nice bam that right there i'm not even about to get i know dress dress uh 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 
point is, man, y'all, I'm dressing point. I was about to say, throw that on with some gray sweat. Boy, man, you will be in the game. But anyway, we are going to be jumping into some detail. After that, we're going to be getting into the box. And then you already know the own foot. And that will be concluding the video. Well, it released in 1986 for the Air Jordan 2. Air Jordan 1 designer Peep Moore in the man behind the Air Force 1. Sorry about that, you guys. Uh, Bruce Kilgore created a silhouette unlike any basketball shoe before it. No, so the person that made the Air Force One is the person that made the Air Jordan One. Sorry about that, you guys, my bad. The Air Jordan Two Chicago is made to the same specs as the original, like fox fur iguana skin, no swoosh, and the original Nike Air Nike wing logos. 36 years later, the Air Jordan Two stands as a symbol of Jordan's brand, bold beginnings. On the heels of Michael Jordan introducing to the fo footwear game, the Air Jordan 2 took him to new heights. MJ scored his first scoring title in 1987 while playing in the silhouette. Only four variation, only four variations were available. Originally two colorways, each in a high and low version. But we, what made the Air Jordan 2 so special at the time was that it combined high-end fashion with basketball performance. The original Air Jordan 2 was the first luxury hoop shoe made in Italy, where their shoe making expertise took, tier, top, took top tier materials and handcrafted touch made all the difference. Each pair featured fox fur iguana skin, sleek lines, and most noticeable, no swoosh, you guys. Now, we needed that swoosh though. This was more than just a pivotal moment in Jordan's footwear design. While laced up in the Air Jordan 2, MJ will go on to win his first slam dunk trophy and accomplish the NBA's second ever 3,000 point session. Down to the Air Jordan 2 box, you guys, I really do like the box design on here. It has that wing Jordan logo box. Uh, look better, I say. It, it, even the box cutout has like a wing cutout to it as well. Now, do any other high Air Jordan 2 boxes come like this? I'm not the box expertise. I wouldn't know. What I would like to find out, I would like to know, man. If anybody in the comments knows, please let me know if any of like Jordan 2 that you guys have uh, copped or received or have, or have. Do they all, do all the boxes look like these right here? Because most Jordan shoes don't really get special boxes. I think the only ones that get special boxes is just certain Jordans, like, my Air Jordan 11 Cool Gray got a special box. My Air Jordan uh, 11 Jubilee got a special box. Uh, the Air Jordan ones that I recently got, like the denim, the denims and the uh, yellow toes, got colorways, but the same like regular Air Jordan one box. Uh, uh, you see that nine right there? Uh, what does it say? It says Air Jordan 2 Retro, white varsity, red, black. And then it goes to Hispanic uh, nine size nine. You already know where the size nine size eight in the UK. And we are gonna go into the inside of the box. We don't get nothing special. I would've liked, to, oh, we actually, we get something. We get like a little Air Jordan 2 card that they did with receivers with. I would've liked different shoe strings probably, but this is right here, just a little, uh, just a note, man. Just show the design of the shoe, how the design went down and everything. So get the whole design, uh, recap of the shoe hands-on and everything so that's about it with this right here and that's all we get other than that you guys know extra shoe strings no special tissue paper and that's it for the box now with everything been said man i think this is the most part of everything everybody be waiting on as far as my overall opinion overall opinion i'm gonna give it the two for the day and i'm just playing i'm gonna give it eight seven it's an Air Jordan 2, no doubt. I like the shoe a lot. Uh, I'm gonna I'm let y'all decide how the own foot look, man. You feel me? I'm not even gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna let y'all decide how the own foot look, man. So y'all can see how that own foot came out and see how the shoes look on feet. They look nice. And then sometimes they don't look nice. Like I said, women would do magic in these shoes, bro. They, they feel the look A1. It, it, it just look gorgeous in these shoes. Like, not even. Nothing bad, I'm not even like, I'm just saying like, the smallest version of this shoe for women who have smaller feet, I think this shoe will look great on y'all feet. No, no cap right there. That's coming from me right there. No cap, this shoe will look great on y'all feet. All Jordan look great on y'all feet if y'all have small feet. But I think this one right here will be a big hit on y'all feet as well. Now, that is it everyone, man. This is your boy Hollywood Troy, man. I would like to say happy holidays, Merry Christmas, Merry, happy Kwanzaa. 
Happy New Year's. Y'all already know New Year's is coming up. Happy New Year's Eve. Everything, man, to everybody out there, man. I would like to send out my regards, man, my love to everybody out there, man. That's been sticking with me for like the past couple years, man. Supporting your boy, man. Subscribing. Uh, yeah, just everything, man. For sticking with me for this long time, man. So, you already know, man. We got a lot of heaters coming up next year, y'all. A lot of heaters. I'm going to go broke as hell buying all the shoes for y'all, man. Just so I get these shoes to show y'all these shoes. Still can't get them early, but hey, you never know, man. I'm working on something. I don't know yet. Anyway, I would like to get those out there early for y'all so I can get that early review, but it is what it is. If I can, I will. Trust me. Anyway, this is your boy Hollywood Troy, man. Don't forget, man, to hit that subscribe, hit that like. Watch the videos, y'all. Watch these videos, man. At least give me five minutes of y'all time, man. Five minutes of y'all day, man. Like I said, five minutes, hit that like, man, hit that subscribe. Really will appreciate that. Also, follow the social media, man. Things going up on the TikTok. -y. And yeah, man. This your boy Hollywood Troy. I'm about to be out, you guys. I'm going to see y'all next year, man. Peace.